is this guy? I'll tell you who he is, Sheriff. The freak of Crystal Cove is my father. Mayor Jones? <gasps> but how did you know? When I found out both pictures of my mother were just cutouts from a magazine, I checked the dates on the back. It was the same day I was born, or what you said was the same day I was born. Still, I wasn't sure. Not until now. Why? Why do you think? Because of the curse. For years, I'd heard about the curse and the supposed haunted treasure. That was the reason I came to Crystal Cove. I'd been accepted to Darrow University's history department, which gave me access to the town archives. When I found the story about the conquistadors that disappeared, I decided to disguise myself and begin my search for the planispheric disk. Sadly, I found nothing, until Mystery Incorporated walked into the library seeking advice. They had no idea what they'd found. Well, that wasn't true. Actually, their mascot knew. For access to my knowledge, Pericles was willing to betray his friends. We concocted a scheme to blackmail the kids into leaving town by threatening them with fabricated documents, implicating their parents in various crimes. They were unaware of my true identity, but I still had one loose end. Pericles had to go. I placed an anonymous call to the police, implicating him in the kid's disappearance. By the time Pericles woke, he was already in custody. He was sentenced to spend the rest of his miserable parrot life where he belonged, in a cage. Becoming mayor allowed me to continue my search for the remaining pieces. Then I would have found them too if it weren't for you, my meddling friend. That still doesn't explain what happened to my mother. I want to know where she is. The truth is, I don't know. I assume she's still with Brad Childs. Wait, are you saying that Judy Reeves is Fred's mother? But that would mean... Brad Childs is your real father. <gasps> Two years after they left, Brad tried to return to Crystal Cove. By that time, he and Judy had married, and she'd given birth to a baby boy. I had to stop Brad. I took you and told them you'd be safe. As long as they never returned again. All this for a treasure no one's even sure exists? Where's the peace? Fred, you're still my son. I raised you. You used me. Where'd you hide it? In your pocket? It's gone? We have to find it. That piece is priceless. Fred! <laughs> Fred! <laughs> Tell me this isn't true.